My Govan and Melonine, and well met indeed. I am Arakir Galadurathan, and welcome back to Middle-earth as we continue on with the battle for Middle-earth, and the final assault on the free peoples of Arnor, with the destruction and defeat of Arthurdine at Fornost, in reverse respective order. Let's get to it then. Fornost, the great capital... Well, it's not the capital. It was possibly the capital. The capital was moved here after Anumanas is abandoned for seemingly no reason. It never gives you a reason why Anumanas is abandoned. Fornost, the capital of men and seat of Isildur's heirs. More than that, it is a symbol to men. Well, I know that plague and just general abandonment. But... Please build me a fortress for free at the start of the mission. Sorry, what? Fear the Iron Crown. I am eternity. Our power we bring. Uh, we appear to be missing Death. a fundamental feature of. <laughs> How on earth are we going to get... What, what, has, what has happened here? Surely I'm supposed to have more troops than this. So what's the initial goal? Enter the city of Fornost and destroy the citadel of Fornost. Alright. Please at least give me a builder. Surely. Go and destroy that for me. What have we still got here? Oh, that's some wraiths, we'll deal with them. Crush the Hobbit counter attack. Ah, here they go. They're running away. Oh, yes, and they're building us a fortress for free. Oh, thank goodness for that. Oh, good, 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 good. Where's the Hobbit counterattack? Oh, here they come. You're going to be team two. Slow and methodical wins the day. Where did Karsh go? Broke down the gate, which is nice. Are they in range? Oh god, they're in range. Pull back. Upgrade the walls. Chuck in a couple of towers just in cases. Don't go too far, chaps. Let's not, let's not be over the top. Let's not be zealous about this. We will defeat them. Their death is, ne is n inevitable. Inevitable. Well, at least we've got a fortress. And I must confess, that last episode, people were saying the return to the Barrow Downs mission would be the hardest one. And I grant you, it was more difficult, but I wonder if it's just a... a um, a consequence of the age of the game but um, none of the missions really have proven to be a challenge and the only ones we actually ended up losing were the ones where we thought we would be able to rebuild buildings only to find out that we weren't able to and those are the only ones that have presented us with a challenge oh brilliant elvish counter attack you guys are just going to clear the walls if you can I don't really care if you die, to be honest. You can kill my builders this time. I've got a fortress. 
So it don't matter, does it? Nice. All right, so all of you then. Come and kill these. Then let's come and destroy some of these so that I can get some resources. Have they got posting gate? Oh, yeah, they're almost certainly. What's the task? Destroy the citadel. Right. Did we lose our... Yeah, we did. They have no... Witch King, come and get involved, sir. They cannot bear my might. Oh dear. <laughs> nice. <laughs> right, we got that destroyed. Where's Morgan here? Oh, he's in there amongst all of those. All shall kneel before me. I have stone and iron to use for rank. I am first of the king's men. I am needed at camp. Which king can deal with that? Um, and let's pop in some giants. Yeah, nicely done. Take out the trebs more than the, we're not worried about the towers at the moment. The darkness waits. Work, or it's the thrall we can't build too near their walls because their trebuchets will build hit us. Strong. In fact, that is almost certainly within range of their trebuchets. Must grow the hobbits attacking, by the way, is as funny as it is, is lore accurate. The hobbits, it is said in their own um, tellings and their own stories. They sent reinforcements to Fornost at the destruction of the city. It's not recorded in the histories of men, but it is recorded in the Hobbit histories. So it could well just be Hobbit propaganda. They are tricksy, those little hobbits is. All shall kneel before the Iron Crown. Oh, that didn't die. I has come for the West. Our new building is ready. Right, we want some uh, more catapults so that we can just clear the wall. Oh, actually, that's a terrible place to build it. Build it over here so it's near the front. Oh, they're destroying my buildings. Stop destroying my buildings! They are weak. They're going to destroy it, aren't they? Oh, no, 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 no. Should be able to get off. Right, we need to find their siege workshops and end it. There's one up there. But what we need here is just a ton of archers, I think, with heroes for cover. So that's my plan. Don't go in there. I am first of the king's men. Right, so heroes, you're going to be team one. And then you, and you, and you. I'd like you to just run in and die. I mean, I don't really have a cause for you. The darkness waits. Don't let the trolls see you slacking. I am first of the king's men. We are ready right, and then you're going to stay alive, though, because you are going Get to become the main strong. army. We're just going to archer our way through the centre. Build it strong. Go and start shooting at that. Oh, they're using the post and gates now as well. <sighs> now, the only advantage we have is that every building that falls is never rebuilt. That is all we have in our favour. Yes, avalanche. Hello, all. Oh, 
you can do it, my two little warrior people. The catapults are helping. The catapults are helping. Oh no, I didn't move my head. Oh, these kind of levels just bore me. I must confess, and I apologise, it'll probably come through in the recording, but they non-stop. Oh, they don't need any resources, and they don't need to build any buildings. They just attack you forever, and you've got to defend in three different locations all at once, because that's really fun, isn't it? It just it just bores me. Like Our victory is an inevitability. An inevitability. Even if we just sit and wait for Avalanche to, be, uh, to free itself up. But we've destroyed their trebuchet, trebuchet production on that side, and I think that is actually the only trebuchet production. I build for the Witch King's Golden Iron to use for Rangmar. I'm ready. The darkness waits. Um, they're taking that down. Right, come and destroy that one now. Work, or it's the thrall hordes for you. Toil for the iron crown to work or you'll be thrown to the wall. The enemy is attacking our forces. Oh, that one down there needs rebuilding. Build that. Stop running up to attack them. Why do you keep doing that? Just stand over here and wait. I don't have anything I can help you with, guys. That's right, the archers are terrible against you. Right, we're going to break you up into two groups then. So... Kash and the Witch King, you're going to be Team 1. You guys are going to be Team 2. Just attack whatever you like. Yeah, our builders are constantly being killed. They're only, the, apparently the only thing they know how to do. Here's more work for you lazy worms. I am first of the king's men. Angron oh, this one survived. Well done. Well done, sir. You are now... You shall be remembered in history as the builder that lived. Now, if we got inside the city, we'd get the gold from the buildings that have been destroyed. But. Where's the cavalry? Oh, the cavalry's up at the back. Alright, next time we get um, spell reinforcements, we'll send it out and get the cavalry to kill that. Bring down the tower. Oh, do they get three of those for free? They do, don't they? Oh, you little buggers. Oh, they're coming from behind, aren't they? And then they come through. Yep. attack. And the forge has gone down again. Get me my archers. Let's get some archers. Let's get some siege up finally and then just push through. Oh, Kash, you don't do very well against siege, do you? All shall kneel before me. Move these over that side. Don't let the trolls see you slacking. Build it for the witch king. The fire's burning on you, Dark Iron Forge. Forge. I serve shadow now. Rogash, go over there for me, would you, son? Shall kneel before the Iron Crown. You guys attack that. Let's get those ice munitions. No man can stand the no greater than ever. Our forces are under attack. We finished that one. Destroy our mills. The enemies return. I have stone and iron to use for anger. Get back to work. You'll be thrown to the walls. Alright, you are going to just stay there and handle that one. Well, Kash actually can do that on his own. Witch King, you'll come into the middle. Morgamir will join you. And Rogash. Oh, Rogash, you're not very good, are you? The blood has started to spill. All 
shall kneel before I am done with the that king's one. men. They're under attack by the Trebs again. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, where are you going? What are you doing? Your build for the Iron Crown oh, has dear. begun. The ice munitions are cold enough now. Others are under attack. It becomes splinters. He's gonna die. Battle is joined. Where are we under attack now? Oh, no, no. All right, it's okay though. We can start getting the rangers now. The Iron Crown calls. We must fight them off again. Oh, we that's shown up that side. Oh, there's an amphitheater. The top iron forge has been expanding. Our forces are under attack. Making money is proving to be a, a bit of a challenge, isn't it? They have no men of Angmar. Right, which can go in and destroy that barracks. Get another one of them. There we are, well done, Witch King. Pull back, Morgan will help you. Did we destroy the stables? Yes, well done, well done. And then we can avalanche this area. Should destroy all three of those buildings in one go. Oh, well done. Alright, team four, let's bloody well go and end this. <laughs> I'll get another sto troll stone throw for you in a moment. I think the Witch King and Morgamir are going to need to stay there to make sure that the... In fact, I think, to be honest, just Karsh leading the way. Let's make Karsh Team 1, let's make you Team 2, and you're going to be Team 3. Got another one of them coming. And we can get the banner carriers out. Oh, it's probably going to tell us we're out of uh, pop cap now. Yeah, there we go. Our army can't get any bigger! You're going to need to be team three then. Well, actually, what I'd quite like is you, to, you to be honest, to, to just die, so I can train a newer, better one. I can't delete you. Men of Angmar, the banner carriers are here. We don't have enough resources for that. Uh, it's training. We rule the Team two, in you go. Let's bloody Our well do this. We must fight them off, again. off we go, off we go. We can at least get you to level two. Send them back. Perfect. Keep shooting. And then in a moment we can get you ice munitions. We get another one. Why didn't we get another one? We killed the. Uh, the Witch King's command. We killed the, the other one that we had. The Iron Crown calls. Please. The 
fighting has begun. We bring silent death. The whisperer has been banished. Oh gosh, did die. Oh, there we go. We are now getting some because some of them are dying. Oh, that fires really slowly. Oh dear, no, we need more than that. Oh dear. We definitely need uh, a hero unit to lead. Karsh doesn't appear to be the best option. I think the Witch King will probably work there. Why is that taking so long to destroy these buildings? Get that building out of the way. Oh, that's a tower. Oh, that explains much. Uh, the Witch King's helping. Morgamir's doing sod all. You're ready to come and join in. They got. Are they training at tier five? They are, aren't they? And we don't get a heal. Oh no, they are training at level one. So all the level fives are the ones they had already. We need more siege. Oh yeah, look, our base has just been <sighs> wiped out. Of course it has. Of course it has. The slow, thumping march of the trebuchets killing everything in our way. Why is it taking the towers, the siege crew, so long to destroy everything? What is your aversion to just destroying crap? Goodness sake. I don't care about destroying any of the outer buildings, though. Not in the slightest. Um, we All we need to do is destroy the citadel, and we're just going to push for it. But I'm going to use this to help clear up some... Well, I don't know, actually. No, that seems like a waste. Let's just save it up. We might be able to destroy the... Oh, you're going to die now, aren't you? Yeah, there you go. He's dead. Our job a little easier. Oh, well done, you're destroying a building. More than most of our armies do. We lost the Witch King, didn't we? We can train him back. 3,750. Goodness gracious. Can you build us more of these? Ah, oh, yes you can. Here's more work for you lazy words. Interesting that the trebs are only coming down the middle. What we need to do is move our builders up actually now. That's where we're at that point now, aren't we? Get these buildings out of the way so that the enemy doesn't have something to cover, to cower behind. Build it for the Witch King. 
We're done with that one. Get back to work. We're looking prone to the wolves. Toil for the Iron Crown. Rangers, ready. Right, that's the one that's a tower. Right, up we go, Team 3. Destroy the gate. Does one hit is all you need? No, two hits are needed. And then to take out the tower for me. It's very annoying that we don't get a heal. Oh, let's get that. Launch chunks of ice. Get ready to build. Our new building is complete. Send them back. Rangers disengage. We wait for battle the sky. We spotted the enemy's camp. Why did you need to go all that way in? Got the buggers. Does that wall really get in your way that much? I mean, come on, guys. Let's use some brain cells. We can launch a chunk of ice at something now. And we don't have a great range on it, so it's pretty useless. But we can still do it. Do it over there. We're too low on resources. Any danger? No, it doesn't work. Right, team three, up we go. Is there really only one of you left? Oh! Will you just go and die? Wait the Witch King's command. Get back to work. Build it, Battle is joined. Keep shooting. Now we need. Oh, thank goodness for that. We got the wolf. Could not have come at a better time, Wolfman. Thank you very much. It's ridiculous. They're on a non stop, constant building. The wolf can get them. You'll build for the iron we crown. Found an enemy camp. Get we found an enemy sword. camp. Of course we have. We're in the enemy's bloody area, aren't we? We're we expecting to find. Wolfman's still going. How'd you like your wolfman? Frozen. Gigantic. I've got you covered. Oh, he keeps just knocking it out of the way rather than killing it. <laughs> oh, blimey. Where have we over here? It's the government building. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's the central structure of Minas Tirith. Now the eastern side is clear. The hall of the king's men is greater than ever. Now we just need a shed load of stone throwers to go and destroy the main central building, and we're done. <laughs> I think. Down it goes. We need to destroy the gate to see through, though. Or surely their presence will then let us see through. Up 
we go, up we go, up we go. We rule the forest. Join with them. Take another one. I'll take another two. The hall of the king's men is greater than ever. Another siege catapult on route. What are you call troll stone thrower? Oh dear. Yep, we're all dead. Right. So all over again. Don't let the trolls see you slacking. Work or it's the thrall hordes for you. We need more ground forces, I suppose. We need something to hold back the cavalry. They've just got hordes of cavalry. Doesn't really matter what you guys do, so you might as well stop. We have like no resources. The Dark Iron Forge has been expanded. Mm, and they're coming for us. They're attacking the force. Our new building is ready. Pin them down. We can at least kill off a bunch of them. I didn't even kill them. Rangers, ready. We are ready to strike. Oh, there's Arvidui. The Dark Iron Forge has been oh, well, at least we'll probably kill him. Well, not probably. He's going to die. Yeah, he's gone. All right, we need to be a bit more clinical in our killing of the uh, bloody Dunedain. But then look how much damage the cavalry does. <laughs> Oh my giddy aunt. Oh nice. Get the Dunedain killed off. I don't, I don't care too much about the cavalry at the moment. Which mills are being attacked? Oh, this one right here. Yes, with the Murda spearmen in the front lines now. That was going to be the Witch King's job, actually, wasn't it? And I then got him killed. Oh, they went off to chase our thing down. Oh, they caught it. <laughs> oh, dear. Just keep them pinned, men of Rudow. Just keep them pinned. The Ice Rangers will deal with it. Finally. Crime. Right, that was Arvidui dead. That was their last gasp. We've got a siege, a troll stone throw moving up. Two more to come. The avalanche will be ready by the time we get there. And all we need to destroy is that bloody thing at the back. <laughs> or is the citadel the central structure? I can't remember. Oh, 
Alright, and then the, got a couple. Let's wait for at least those two to move up. And then we'll go through and kill the last ones. Killed off, please. We are ready to strike. We will never know. Our third one of them should be coming through now. Fighting has begun. We bring silent death. Cleared away. A one tower survived. We are ready to strike. We bring silent death. We've snuck in round the back. We've done that most annoying of Solaris based tactics. So it's not that we're in Sins of the Solar Empire, sorry, not Stellaris. Where the enemy has built a star base directly in front of the access point of the star lane. And we've flown our fleet in. We've come immediately told them to not engage the star base. We've flown around it and then buggered off out the other star lane. And now we're decimating all of their helpless, defenseless planets behind that large star base. We wait for battle. But that is it. 37 minutes later, not having destroyed everything, we've made our way through. And the fortress will fall. <laughs> yes! Oh, thank goodness for that. It certainly does, Witch King, it certainly does. And that is it. I'm afraid to say uh, the Witch King's force is obviously routed almost immediately after the Battle of Fornos by the coming Gondorians and the united force of Glorfindel, Círdan of Mithlond and Iarnur, I believe, of Gondor. Is that his name? Uh, and anyway, the Witch King's army is utterly decimated. The Witch King himself flees the north forevermore, never to return. And uh, he scampers off back down to Mordor, where he then goes and licks his wounds. Arnor is utterly destroyed, and the free peoples eventually win. If the Gondorians had arrived in Arnor own days earlier than they did, then Arnor wouldn't have fallen. Uh, and I dislike that Tolkien wrote it to be that close. I, think, I always think that's annoying. It should have been years. It should have been Arnor decimated them, then marched all the way up to the Grey Havens, and then the Gondorians arrived. I don't like it that it's like days later. I think it's a bit silly. But that concludes for now. Now, I might take a bit of a break from Battle of Middle-earth for a while just to give the new Beastmen Warhammer campaign a couple of weeks of two episodes a week. Uh, and then in maybe a month's time, something like that, we will return and play through as the Evil Nations. And for now, that is it. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, despite particularly that last mission, me just finding it, to be honest, dull. I thought I would enjoy it more, but I just dislike it when you get attacked immediately, non-stop, straight away. And granted, it wasn't anything particularly hard, but those that's the problem. They send a pathetic nothingnesses against you. So you, and you just think, you might as well just send nothing against me, and then I can at least just win this quicker. Like, either send all the troops that you'd built sitting around doing sod all. Either send them all, or send nothing. But sending one trebuchet every now and then, so you, and you forget about it, and you're constantly losing your mills, it's just, <laughs> it annoys me. But I do hope you've enjoyed it, nevertheless. But until we speak again, dear friends, Navar, Naden, Perimad, Melonin, and farewell.